Yes, well, I am pretty young um, to be writing a memoir, but I feel that no one has actually spoken about that decade of kind of growing up um, on kind of the vintage online world and MSN and MySpace and all of that stuff. And even though it was recent, I feel like the internet has changed so much since then that in internet years, I feel like it's been hundreds of years. So um, yeah, I just feel like it's kind of untouched that decade um, where my age group of like 20 somethings were kind of experimenting online. So I thought I'd kind of, yeah, unearth all of that stuff. Um, well, I review books for my blog as well. So I get sent a lot of, of books, which is amazing. Um, so yeah, I have to sort of make sure that I just finish them because I, I sometimes have like lots on the go at once, and, like cheating on each other, the books. Um, so I'm massively into memoir though, I must say. A lot of my recommendations are non-fiction. I sometimes read them and then actually listen to them on audiobook afterwards because I feel that there is something magical about reading, but then sometimes their writing style is so much how they would say it in real life that I just want to hear it. I think it's definitely harder to get noticed now. If you're different and you're unique and you have something really important to say, you can totally cut through the noise. I'm seeing so many up and coming people who, you know, might have just started their blog a year ago, but because it's so different, um, it's really cutting through. I think that's really exciting.